Hello, I'm Bradley, and welcome to my channel. First things first, if you're new here, please subscribe. You don't have to, of course, but it would really help me out in where I'm trying to get my channel to be. Okay, so today we are talking about my ninth Invisalign tray, or whatever you want to call it. <laughs> I always get quite stuck on what to call it, but my ninth Invisalign. And you know what? I am absolutely outstanding. Every time I do these clips to capture which uh, vision line I'm on, um, I'm just absolutely just taken back by how the progress is just, to be quite honest with you, just shot on. Um, it's a progress which, um, it's a process, sorry, which is really, really outstanding me. It is something which just the ease of being able to straighten your teeth, um, and this is me speaking from my heart here, the ease of being able to straighten your teeth is just incredible with a vision line. Yes, I'll be honest, it can be quite painful at times. It can be uncomfortable. And the thing I really didn't like about it, first of all, was when I first started having them, because I'm on my ninth tray of 14. Um, and what I didn't like about them the first time, uh, the first or number one, and then probably, probably coming up to about the second one, I was still having days where I could be quite conscious of what was happening, where I had quite a lisp, and I really didn't like that. And the person, the specialist, who I'm having my treatment through, didn't really make me aware of that, so I was quite taken back by just how much of kind of a, of, it really did feel like for, at first until I got used to it. And you do get used to it, I want to put that up, that you certainly do get used to it, but it really did feel like, um, another piece of plastic on my teeth, which of course in essence is exactly what it is, but it really did feel like I had that there, so it was quite difficult to talk, and in my job, um, I'm talking, presenting data, presenting figures to high, higher um, profile members of staff in sort of real senior figures, so I have to be able to talk clearly, I have to be able to pronounce every single syllable, I have to be able to put myself across professionally. Um, and rather than having a lisp, it was really, really quite difficult. Um, so yeah, absolutely. And of course, that's that's nothing sort of against anybody in society or anybody who's having anything like that at all. It is simply just saying the product which I have got here to straighten my teeth, and which a lot of other people use, I really wasn't kind of ready for that big sort of change. But you know, it's a fantastic, uh, it really is a fantastic process. And I mean, I had braces back when I was when I was 18, I had braces back then, wired braces. I'm now 29 years of age, um, and I had these back because in about the last year, just to quickly recap, um, this side of my teeth here, the arch was really collapsing in. I'm going through lots of different kind of health problems and things in the background, just having a lot of tests and one thing or another, and potentially some collagen issues. Um, so they weren't sure whether or not that was... Uh, as a result of what I was, I'm, I'm sort of being investigated for, or what's potentially happening in the background. Um, but to be on, but to be honest with you, we're dealing with it. It's hugely improved already. I've got trays 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 to go, and I'm loving the results. I mean, I love the results two trays ago. So uh, I'm just astounded about how the results are going to be on number 14 because it is, as I say, I'm really happy with my teeth now, and it very much is that fine tuning. Trays, I would say, seven, six, seven, and eight. I'm going to say were quite painful in those first couple of days. Number nine, I've really had no discomfort to be quite honest with you at all. So I'm expecting a lot of discomfort on uh, tray ten. Um, but yeah, um, now straight away have, I've had no problems at all, no dry mouth because, of course, in different uh, aligner trays which I've had, it's given me quite an uncomfortable, quite a dry mouth when I've been talking lots as well. Um, a lot of my subscribers will know that I do like to talk, <laughs> and that's probably why some of my clips do go on a little bit. Um, but however, when you are passionate about something or you want to really stress to get something across in your channel, um, and integrity is everything, so I'm always open and honest and I cover absolutely everything, um, I do tend to be able to talk a little bit more than probably what some people may agree would be acceptable. However, um, I like to cover everything. And yeah, so it's great. Number nine, I've had no problems to report, um, no uncomfortableness, gums are all fine. He really, really happy. I've got, now by the way, that sort of black area you can see, it's not decay, it's not nothing going on, it's the sort of barcode stamp on the Envision Lines. I've got it at the top here as well, um, but at the bottom it's more prominent. And 
my twin brother thought it would be appropriate the other day to point out that ah, you've got something wrong with your teeth at the back. No, I haven't. Thank you very much. It is a barcode on top of the teeth. <laughs> There's nothing wrong. So to report number nine in Visualina, really fine. Didn't really feel anything, which surprises me. So I'm really sort of preempting that number 10 is going to be really quite uncomfortable, quite painful. I've had no problems at all, nothing to report, changed it, I'm due to change on to number 10 in a couple of days time, we're on Friday now, Monday I'm due to change on number 10, no issues, I've just noticed some fine tuning of the shape of my teeth, and the arch of my teeth, that kind of bow of my teeth, and um, yeah, I mean, just straight away, it's just so, and by the way, if we're looking at this and what my problem was, why I had a visual line, was because this had really come in. So when I smiled, and some of my subscribers will probably remember this from when I smiled on my channel, that actually this was really shadowed. So it almost looked that I didn't have the teeth there almost, and that they were almost back in. Um, and you can probably actually, if I show now, it's probably got a little bit further to go. So looking at it like that, not a problem. But then when I go like that, I can see there's a little bit more further to go, but not too much. I'm really, really pleased with the results already, as I was two, two um, Vision Line trays ago. I was really, really pleased with it. Um, but yeah, it's just getting better and better and better. And I would wholeheartedly recommend them to anyone. Now, being open and honest, they are an investment. OK, they are an investment. They are not cheap. OK, I will say that. Um, but it is an investment in yourself. So if you are in that uh, position, then fantastic. You do have a look at them. But then there are opportunities and possibilities out there for uh, sort of monthly plans, one thing or another. And they are affordable. They really, really are. I don't want to put that out there. Um, I've had a, I've had a few comments, one thing or another there in regards to um, sort of sort of like it being a, a sort of a. Uh, a product or sort of a treatment which actually you have to throw a lot of money into it and it's okay for some people that type of thing not nastiness but suggestions um and to be quite honest with you um i absolutely wholeheartedly appreciate that i really really do that it would not be feasible for everybody um but unfortunately it was an issue which i really did have to uh sort of correct now i didn't have to but there was a possibility that the arch of my teeth could keep collapsing, cause me some problems, and I had some issues with my jawbone as well. Um, so it was best sort of suggested that I went ahead with the treatment. I did speak a long time with the person who's been doing my treatment, um, and that original person um, was from who done my original treatment actually back when I was only 18 years of age. So fast forward uh, 10 years. I was about 18, 19 then. So fast forward 10 years, it's going brilliantly. Everything's as, as well as what I would like. Um, and I absolutely, as I say, wholeheartedly recommend. And if anybody would like to ask me any questions or any concerns, or perhaps you're watching this, you're thinking, oh, what a lot of rubbish. Leave me a comment. Let's, let's, let's discuss it. Do you know what I mean? My channel is all about integrity and honesty. If there is something which you think, actually, that's wound me up a little bit, drop me a message and I will absolutely be honest and open and come back to you. I really will. I've had a few comments um, in the past where they've been quite personal, quite hurtful to be quite honest with you as well. Um, and that's not my intentions at all. That's not my intentions at absolutely whatever. Um, in this life, I, I, I try to help everybody. I try to be positive. I try to be bright. I try to be helpful to everybody. The last thing I ever want to do is to insult somebody or to make an assumption through not even knowing that I'm doing that. And if, if I have done so, please do forgive me from that, from my heart to yours. And on that note, thank you very, very much for watching. It really does mean the world to me. Every time you click and watch a clip on my channel, it really does. Every second somebody sits in front of me, in front of their whatever the device they're using and watches me it really really does it humbles me it really really enlightens me and it really really does touch my heart so for that thank you very much and god bless take great care thank you very much for watching this and until next time i'll be seeing you on a visual line tray 10 and hopefully it's not going to be too painful i do think it's going to be though um but we will see you then but for now number nine really really pleased okay so thanks very much until next time i'll see you then bye for now